hi guys i'm rachel if you're new or returning welcome or welcome back i do fragrance beauty and lifestyle i hope you stay to the end everything i speak about will be listed in the description box along with all my other social media platforms i like to have you over there as well today i'm giving you some everyday easy reach perfumes these are perfumes you can wear anytime anywhere no fuss no muss if you're just getting into perfumes you just want to build a simple perfume collection remove the guessing game of fall and winter summer spring perfumes just want to build a simple perfume collection that you will always smell good keep on watching so let's start with a classic la via belle by lancome this is a best-selling perfume for a very good reason if you love alluring feminine sweet fruity florals this is the one for you they've also extended the line and there are a bunch of flankers i even need to upgrade because i want to put one of a flanker in my collection i just don't know which one yet i have some more sampling to do but they all smell so good this is a really nice crowd pleaser and perfect for anyone who's just getting into perfume this is the this is the place to start in the opening there's a lot of pear and it stays throughout the wear of the perfume. Then you get the white florals, orange blossom, some jasmine, a little powdery from the iris and very sweet from the prilling and the vanilla in the base. And it's also a little earthy from the patchouli. So like I said, I need to sample some more because I need a newer version in my collection. And this is a very, very long lasting. Next we have Montal's Sweet Flowers. If you love Flower Balm by Victor and Rolf, this is a must try. I personally do not like Flower Balm, but this is a great alternative to that for So me. this is another sweet scent, but it's fun, it's playful, and it's very, very long lasting. I mean, what do you expect from Montal? I remember wearing this one day and I was in the elevator, it stopped and the guy was about to take the elevator and he just stood in front of the elevator and he was like, Miss, you smell so good. This is a really nice smelling scent. It's very crowd pleasing as well. It's very sweet, but there's also a little spiciness from the ginger and pepper it's a little powdery you also get some of the oak moss and the patchouli but not too much patchouli it's not nothing that's overpowering also i don't find that this has the typical montal dna it's not a very over complex scent or very unique scent but it's a good one and not every perfume has to be complex and unique sometimes you just need those simple things in your collection if you're building a perfume collection again we have montal's sweet flowers here we have mancera's velvet vanilla a sweet fruity floral with a creamy vanilla base tuberose is definitely the star here but it does have other florals like jasmine and rose and to me it leans more floral than fruity but i also do get a little bit of the pear in here that rhyme just a really nice blend is very dense and very feminine at the same time longevity for this is days on your clothes and it has really good projection as well i mean most mancera perfumes are great performers so again we have mancera's velvet vanilla here we have Glossier's You. This is um, one of those your skin but better perfume and I feel like every woman should have some variation of this in your collection. The time comes in when you need those kind of perfumes. This perfume somehow emulates your body's chemistry and just really smells like you. It's like the perfect name for this perfume. It smells different on everyone. This here is my second bottle and I am almost ready for my third. Do you see the dent? Can you see the dent? leaves are really nice sensual i always always get compliments when i wear this perfume and it lasts forever on me i know that some people said it doesn't last but i do not experience this one day i wore this perfume from 11 a.m and at 8 p.m i was getting compliments on this perfume i've had people follow me and said you left a trail like what are you wearing so i cannot speak to it not being a perfume that lasts but i know perfume performs different on a lot of people but for me it's very long lasting it's warm and sensual it's powdery it's musky. This is just a beautiful scent. It's mass appealing and it's very well done. Again, we have Glossy AU. Another Your Skin But Better perfume is Juliet Has A Gun, Not A Perfume Superdose. Somehow I become a Nosmic to the original version, so I always go for the Superdose. And this is my second bottle. I also mentioned this perfume in my top 10 for life. I will link it in the card so you can check it out if you haven't as yet. It's very minimal, but it's also very modern. And another one that I always, always get asked what I'm wearing, or I always get compliments, just random compliments whenever I'm wearing this perfume. It's also a really nice perfume to layer with other perfumes. It makes well with almost anything in your collection i also find it quite similar to glossier's you but this one is just a little bit more sophisticated in my opinion it's just so good and the longevity is amazing again we have juliet has a gun not a perfume super dose if you're hearing any noise in my background please excuse me i live very very close to a highway and it's the reason why i have not uploaded for the past two weeks the noise is unbearable right now i'm sitting in my kitchen so if you're hearing any noise it's the fridge like i cannot escape the noise one day it will get better <laughs> 
one day it will get better it's so annoying i cannot wait to move i am over it i am over it now we have an arabian goodie it's called ajwa by latafa it's sweet fruity a little powdery then you get the rose as it dries down and the vanilla comes through making that rose sort of like creamy there's also this metallic scent this metallic thing that i get from this perfume and i actually really love that metallic touch in it it doesn't last however it mellows out as it dries down let me just say if you've tried any arabian perfumes and at first sniff for spray you did not like it give it some time let it macerate because i find that arabian companies do not let their perfumes macerate at all or long enough so give it some time let it sit for a couple of months a couple of weeks and then revisit it and hopefully your mind changes so don't just get rid of a perfume especially arabian if you did not like it letting your perfumes master it is something you can apply to all your perfumes some some perfumes just tends to get better the longer they sit so we have Ashwood by Latafa. This is also a very affordable perfume. It's very sophisticated, very feminine. It doesn't really smell Arabian. Um, I will link it in my Amazon store and I will link my Amazon store in my description for you to check out. We have Schizo by Mila Harris. This is a fresh rose and oud. And for those of you who might want an everyday scent that's a little more intoxicating, stunning and captivating. For me, this is a very feminine perfume and I find it to be very versatile as well. This is a perfume that I blind bought a while ago and um, I did not like it. I was not really impressed with it, but I gave it some time and I went back to it and look at my dent. Look at my dent. It just took me a while to really appreciate this scent because I am someone who always, I always say I like perfumes that has um, depth and character. I'm not saying that this one doesn't, but the rose in here is a fresher rose and the oud is more like a background note and is not so straightforward and in your face. There's also citrus in here and I'm guessing that's where the rose gets this freshness from. So it's not like, it's like a dewy rose. It has good projection but it's not a beast mode perfume, but it's enough to float around you and float in the air that when you pass by, people can actually smell you and you just smell really sophisticated is when I also always get compliments on when I wear it. So we have Schizo by Mila Harris and this is perfect. So there we have it, perfumes you can wear anywhere, anytime, any season, if you're just building a perfume collection. Like I said, everything will be listed in my description box, along with all my other social media platforms. I would love to have you over there as well. Like, comment, share, subscribe, hit the bell so you'll be notified whenever I upload a video. If I'm being honest, I do not know what I'm doing here on YouTube. I'm just recording, I'm posting, it's a learning curve for me and I will get the hang of it. But you subscribing and hitting the bell would definitely help me to reach the masses so please do so and thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video next sunday bye guys